Hello students, hope you all are doing fine. I am your Nanvita ma'am and today I am back again with one, one maths class. Today we are going to learn a completely new topic and the name of the topic is smallest and largest number. Now do you know what smallest and largest are? Yes, small means like very very small and large means big, larger, largest. Similarly, if we look into some objects, see here. Here are two pencils. How many pencils? One, two. Here are two pencils. Here, this pencil is smaller than this one. And among these two pencils, we call this pencil as the smallest one and this one as the largest one. Now, here are two boxes. You can see. Here are two boxes, one blue color, one of peach color. Now, look into these two boxes. If you see this box, this one is much bigger than this one. This one is very small compared to this box. So, we call this box as the largest one and this one as the smallest one. Here are two bottles. Here are two bottles. You can see this one and this one. This is of green color and this is of sky color, blue color. Now, can you tell me which one, which bottle is much bigger or smaller? Which one is smaller and which one is bigger? Yes, this is the smaller one and this is the bigger one. I hope you understand this one. Now, let's look into the book. You can see, I have written here, S, M, A, double and small, E, S, T, S, smallest, A, N, D, and L, A, R, G, E, large, S, T, largest, N, U, M, B, E, R, number, smallest and largest number. This is our heading. Now, look children, here is a number line. You can see, here is a number line. Here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now, I have written some numbers here. Whenever we are counting from up to down, we are getting the largest number. Whenever we are getting up, that time we are getting the smallest number. Now let's say, if I tell you, there are two numbers, 5 and 2. Can you tell me which number is the largest here? Yes, in this number line, if you see, 2 is here, up, and then if you go down, you get 5. So this 2, we counted before 5, so this 2 is the, this 2 is the smallest number. This 2 is the smallest number. And this 5 is the largest number. Similarly, now let's see into some more example. If I write here 1 and if I write here 8, 1 and 8. Now tell me 1, we are getting it up here, then 2, 3, 4, 5. Notice it children, we are counting downward, we are going downward. So whatever number we are getting in the downside are the largest one. Then comes 7, 8. So this 8 comes much later than 1. So this 8 means it is the largest number between 1 and 8. Now look here children, here is 1. So 1 means what? Let's say there is only one flower. Here is 8. It shows there are 8 flowers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So if I tell you there is only one flower with you and your friend has 8 flowers. Now tell me who has more flowers? Obviously your friend. So we can understand from here only that 8 is a larger number. Your friend has larger amount of flowers. 
similarly okay now if you look here here is written 1 and 5 can you tell me which number is the smallest number here here the smallest number we are looking for the smallest number between 1 and 5 if you start counting from 1 to 10 1 you get it here on top and 5 here down after 1 so this 1 means it is the smallest number and if you start counting for 2 and 9 2 is up here and 9 is down here so 9 means more number 9 is the largest number here similarly if i ask you to find out the largest number between 7 and 3 largest number between 7 and 3 now look here i have already told you that whichever number is down there that one is the largest whichever you are getting down up, that is the largest one and whichever you are getting up that is the smallest one now 7 is downward from 3 3 is here and 7 is here so you can always say 7 is the largest number and between 4 and 1 there is 4 there is 1 between this 4 and 1 you can always say that this 4 and 1 largest number is the 4 because 4 is here and 1 is here so this 4 is the largest number i hope you understood this much because we, i am going to give you some more homeworks now students find out the smallest number here and comment it in our comment box it is your homework now students from here you have to find out the largest number you will find out the largest number between 3 and 4 2 and 9 7 and 5 9 and 10 and 1 and 10 and you will write that answer in the comment section thank you